During World War II, there were banners hung in the windows of homes all across America where young men had gone off to service. You remember, one blue star for each son who left, and a gold one if he wasn't coming home. One evening, a young boy was walking down the street with his father. The stars on the banners caught his eye, and after a time, he began counting them. One star in that window, he announced, and one in the next. He clapped his little hands and shouted out, Oh, look, Daddy, there are three stars in that house. He ran up and down the avenue, pointing out stars and pulling his daddy along. Then they got to one house that puzzled him. Look at that big house. It has lots of windows, but there's not even one star. Not even one. Why, Daddy? The father didn't seem to hear his child's question. He felt the little boy was too young to understand the meaning of all those service stars anyway. After all, how does one explain to a five-year-old the loneliness, the hopes, and the fears on the other side of those stars in the window? Then they came to a vacant lot. There were no houses, so no windows to hang service stars. But in the distance was a stretch of dark blue sky where one evening star was brightly glowing. Oh, look, look, the little boy exclaimed. There's one star in God's window. That means God gave a son too. Then, noticing the gold color of that star, he added softly, Oh, but he died. Oh, that's why there's a this is Derek Johnson and the Regeneration, reminding you that because Jesus came then, Christmas is now.